coming down here. Security papers. Oh, you're one of those trackers the commander sent down, right? I should have given you an armed escort. It's nasty down here. We've already lost one patrol. We figure the rack ghouls got them. We've had so many encounters with those things, we've actually run out of rack ghoul serum. Plus, we've had several skirmishes with looters from those lower city swoop gangs. I'm telling you, we should just stay in the upper city where we're in control. Oh, is that why you're down here? Search and rescue. I didn't think they'd send anyone. They were in the southern section of the Undercity when we lost contact. I would have gone to investigate, but my orders are to search for those crashed escape pods, even if it means leaving another patrol to die. Look out! It's an ambush! Ready. That hurt, I bet. Sure. Don't move! I'm... I'm not afraid to use this blaster if I have to. Settle down, kid. We've already lost enough men to those damn rack ghouls. The last thing we need now is more casualties from a needless firefight. Mm. By the looks of you, I'd say you're down here for the same reason we are. To salvage something from those downed Republic space pots. Let me give you some advice. Forget about it. Do yourself a favor and just head back from where you came. Mandalorians don't make threats. We make promises. But I'm just trying to give you a friendly warning. This isn't a good place to stand around chatting. The Undercity is crawling with rat ghouls. I've already lost a half a dozen men to those monsters. Candrus, I heard something. Over there, in the shadows. Sounded like a rat ghoul. 
Looks like we've got company. Get those blasters ready, boys. I told Zavik this salvage mission was a bad idea. His men aren't trained for this kind of thing, and I can't babysit them all. Okay, boys. We're getting out of here before I lose anyone else. I can't carry all this salvage back by myself. You'd be smart to get out of here as well. Even if you can handle the rat ghouls, I doubt there's anything worth finding anymore. Davik sent me down here with this motley crew to scavenge whatever we could from the Republic escape pods that crashed during the recent battle overhead. But the lower city gangs got here first. Anything worthwhile in those Republic pods is probably in their hands by now. Davik won't like that. What are you, an off-worlder? Everyone knows Davik. He's a member of the Exchange. You know, the Interstellar Crime Syndicate. Smuggling, gambling, extortion. Davik controls it all here on Taris. That's why I'm working for him. But lately, the lower city gangs have been giving my boss some trouble. This isn't really the best place to have these kinds of conversations. But I guess I could spare a couple of seconds for you. After all, you did help us out with those rat ghouls. The lower city is overrun with gangs. But the two most important ones are the Hidden Bex and the Black Vulkers. Used to be the Bex were the big dog and kept the others in line. But lately, the Black Vulkers are moving in on Beck turf and challenging them for control. The Vulkers are even starting to defy Davik. Take these escape pods, for example. Everyone knew Davik would want first crack at them. But I know for a fact those damn Vulkers have already sent their own salvage party down here. Come on, boys, let's move out! Ready. Thank you. 
Ready. Welcome back, Upworlder. I'm surprised to see you again. Many of your kind have passed through our village recently, but few have bothered to speak with me or my people. Why have you come into this dark and sunless place? Is there something you need of me or my village? I will help you however I can. You are generous to offer this to us, Upworlder. You have my thanks. But I know nothing of administering the serum. You should bring it to the village healer. As you wish, Upworlder. Should you have need of anything else, come speak to me. I represent the entire village and I will do my best to help you however I can. Yes? Wait, Upworlder. You can't go through this gate. There is too much danger and suffering beyond. For your own sake, turn back. I am Isala, healer of this village. I use my knowledge and what little resources we have to care for the outcasts who are sick or injured. But despite my medical training, there is nothing I can do to help the poor souls locked on the other side of this gate. The villagers infected with the Rakgore disease are quarantined beyond this gate. It's only a matter of time until they transform into horrible creatures that would destroy us all. So you just lock them away in a cage? For the sake of the village, we have to keep the infected ones locked away. And when they finally do transform into rock ghouls, we'll let them destroy each other. Your offer is generous, Upworlder, but the serum is useless to us now. The villagers infected with the rat ghoul disease have been quarantined beyond this gate. At any moment, they could be transformed into terrible monsters. Nobody would be foolish enough to risk going into the pens to give them the cure. The infected ones could transform into rat ghouls and attack them at any moment. I can't help the infected ones. They have to die so that the rest of the village can live. I accept this. If you think that makes me a coward, so be it. I can't stop you from going through the gates, Upworlder. But if the infected ones have already transformed into rock ghouls, you'll be walking into your grave. have to help us. We beg you. We don't want to end up like the others. Please help us. We can't end up like them. We have the Rack Ghoul disease. It is only a matter of time until we are transformed into terrible creatures like those who attacked you when you first came into the pen. It is too late for them, and soon it will be too late for us, and we will transform into these horrible Rack Ghouls ourselves. 
You... you have a cure. Please, give it to me. Quickly, before it's too late. We... we have nothing, Upworlder. We are outcasts. All we have are the clothes on our backs. Please, Upworlder, show us mercy. Give us the cure out of the goodness of your heart. Quickly, I must inject it before it's too late. Yes, I feel it working. I feel the disease burning away. It's like a miracle. I am cured. Thank you, Upworlder. You have saved us from a fate worse than death. I only wish I had some reward to give you. Maybe you can find something worthwhile in the wreckage of that Republic escape pod. Not long ago, an escape pod crashed in the Undercity, far to the northeast of the village. We were going to try and salvage equipment from it when we were attacked by the Rat Ghouls and infected. I'd tell you more if I could, but our salvage team never reached the pod. It's probably still there. Unless some of the other Upworlders already found it and picked it clean. We should go now, Upworlder. We're anxious to return to the village and see our families again. Thank you once again for everything you have done. You amaze me. I always thought the surface dwellers couldn't care less about us outcasts. But you risked everything to help those infected villagers. I wish I had some type of reward to give you, but we outcasts have nothing. All I can offer is the gratitude of the entire village. Greetings once more, Upworlder. Do you bring news of my apprentice? Have you discovered her fate and proved yourself to be a true savior of my people? You seek my wisdom, but I dare not share my knowledge with you. Not yet. Not until you prove yourself to be the one foretold. The one who will guide us to salvation. Find my apprentice. Discover what fate has befallen her, and I will know you are worthy, and not another false prophet sent to mislead my people. It is as I feared, then. She joins the list of those who have given their lives in the service of our cause. But though I am saddened by this news, there is yet hope. By finding my apprentice, you have proved yourself worthy, Upworlder. You are to be the beacon on our path to salvation. You will guide us to the promised land. You are marked, Upworlder. Even my dim old eyes can see the mantle of destiny that cloaks you. Perhaps old Rukil knows you better than you know yourself. I am old. I have lived a hundred years in the Undercity, cast down into the darkness. I know the legends and history of our people, and now you must learn it too. I offer you wisdom, and you turn me away? Perhaps you are not ready to accept the role you must play in the destiny and salvation of my people. Very well, Upworlder. Return to me when you are ready to learn what you must learn. What?
please. I, I can feel it inside my skin. Something growing. Like some kind of hideous disease. Thank you. Those things, they attacked as soon as we came out the doors. They... they killed the others. It, it was horrible. Bastila? She wasn't in this pod. We were tracking her pod just before we hit the planet's surface. It went down somewhere to the west. We lost the signal when our own pod crashed. Maybe... Wait, what was that? Did you hear that? I thought I heard something. Over there! I heard something, I know I did. There it is again. It's those monsters. They're coming back. Run for your lives! Kill me. I surrender. I surrender. Yeah, sure. Whatever you say. I work for Brezik, head of the Black Volker Gang. He told us to kill anyone who came snooping around. There was one survivor, a female Republic officer. Bastilla or something like that. Brezik took her back to the Black Volker base as his prisoner. You can't. Nobody can. They'll shoot you on sight. Even I couldn't get you in. They'd just shoot us both if we show up there together. Well, you could talk to the Hidden Vex. They're our biggest rival. They might know some way to get in. Look, that's all I know, I swear. Please, just let me go, and I promise you'll never see me again. What? But I surrendered! Damn you!
me now? Does this mean you're gonna help me get Zalbar back? It's a deal. As soon as we get Big Z back, I'll show you a way into that Volker base. Now come on! We have to find Zalbar before they sell him to slavers, or worse. Do you know where he's being kept? The Gamorians make their camps in the sewers. I bet that's where we'll find Zalbar. And that's where I'll show you the secret entrance into the Volker compound. Oh. <laughs> 